of the Alpha Academy, the big man. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, representing the Alpha Academy from Superior, Wisconsin, weighing in at 330 pounds, Otis. Well, some would say Otis used to be an inspiration. Now he could not be less interested in the WWE Universe. He may not be interested, but Otis is inspired. Inspired to annihilate you, to end you with one move. That's the kind of power possessed by this man. Man, Otis is an amazing mass of humanity. He could probably crush any man in that ring. Well, this man looks to massacre who's ever in front of him. This is gonna be good. And his opponent, from Adelaide, Australia, weighing in at 330 pounds, Brad Sound Reed. The WWE Universe has been counting the days, hours, and minutes for this match to start, and the countdown is almost over. A competitor who always has his game face on, ready for a major battle. This superstar is coming in with a lot of enthusiasm and energy right now. But what's going to happen when the excitement wears off and he comes to realize he's in a fight against someone looking to take his head off? All I can say is we've seen adrenaline take this superstar very far in the past. Well, unfortunately for him, he's facing Otis tonight. I'm not going to lie. I kind of miss you. Up the top. Rough landing. Able to avoid him. He went right into that turnbuckle. Big splash in the corner. And he's taking this to the outside now. Quick thinking pays off. Getting carried. I'm sure what they're thinking. Don't do this. Don't do it. Corey, do you think Otis is a better superstar today than he was back? when he was all about stakes and weights. No, absolutely, Cole. Otis has always been a world-class wrestler with an incredible amateur background. But now Otis is actually using that instead of dancing like a goof for the WWE Universe. Yeah. Ooh! Ooh! Uh-oh! Otis was just a step slow. And Otis was ready there. And a clothesline. Big splash. Showing off their deadlifting prowess and just tossing them aside. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. And the resolve of Otis might be wavering. Otis is running to a roadblock. Otis might be able to start mounting something here. Otis trying to bring the fight back in this one. Placed into the corner. Otis scooping up his opponent for the slam and whoa. What is Otis thinking? What is Otis doing? No! No! Splash! Cover! Two! Yeah, no. He doesn't get the 
three. He just Ooh. won't give up. Oh, my. Apron sent on. Ooh. Gentlemen, in the interest of self-preservation, I may have to excuse myself. Saxton, you hang tight. Let this play out. And it's a long way down from there. Uh oh, from the top. Step there. That was nasty. Will Otis make it pay off? Cover! What a kick out at two! Oh, I thought that was game over. Pure guts to kick out there. And now Alpha Academy's so-called number one guy is going to have to lean on his teachings to remain composed in this situation. There he goes, right into the corner. Counters, this could be an opportunity. Counter after counter. And Zagiri finds his mark. It's been an elacious encounter thus far. The tides have swung in multiple directions. It's anyone's guess how this one's gonna end. Uh-oh! Elbow throw saying not today. And the attack from Otis avoided. Counter upon counter. Great minds thinking alike. Set him up for something here. To the outside. He's running on empty right now. Might want to walk it off or shake it off or do whatever he needs to do to get his head in the game here. Two. Heads out of the ring but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. And gets tossed back into the mat. Climbing up top. He's got big plans. From the heavens. Big time splash. Special, but this one just raised the bar even higher. I bet the whole locker room was watching this one by the end of it.